So today, it's, it's a little bit of an unusual one. I know there's a surprise component to it. Jack has basically been feeding me the information. I know he's partially behind it in collaboration with Nissan. And I'm like... So anyway, I gave him the keys to the new studio. And now he asked me to come over there and visit. Let's see what's up. It's a very, very large box. Click me. <laughs> this, this is more what I'm used to here. To Lewis from Santa, okay. I legitimately do not know what to expect in here. I feel like it's Christmas morning over here or something. Whoa. That is legit. This is like movie realistic right here. There's a little base for it as well. Star Wars Death Trooper one to one scale helmet replica. Wow. Check that out. I'm not sure what's going to happen when I hit this button, but uh, I mean, it says click me, so. You know what we gotta do. <laughs> Whoa! What? I'm catching the theme now, the Rogue One theme. This thing looks like a stormtrooper, right? With the with the black grill and the black wheels. Rogue One. Star Wars limited edition. You've got some Star Wars emblems on the back over here. Right here to be reminded that you've got the limited edition. Watch, look at that. There's a light up Star Wars logo right here. Oh, even, and the floor mats are special as well. Oh. I got the glass roof on this one. Real nice. Look inside the cup holders. Similar to the badges on the outside, they're reflected on the inside in the cup holders as well. What the keychain? One in 1,000? <laughs> oh, wow. There's a matte 3D keychain and a glossy 3D keychain, limited edition. That's the rare one, one in 1,000. You got your USB, your auxiliary. I know you guys are gonna be interested in that. Power. All right, so the first one is the shade, right? And then you get the glass, the full panel glass, and then you got the sunroof as well. That's fit for a stormtrooper right there. I notice over here, we got, a, we got a sport mode. This is an all wheel drive SUV, right? As you know, there's an eco mode as well. So there's a display in between your speedometer. I kind of like how they put the flat edge on the steering wheel. Your controls here for answering any phone calls. Of course, it's got the Bluetooth. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm seeing the color now. You see pinkish purple color coming in there? You can change the color, you can theme it out. You change that to red, it's the instant dark side. I'm curious, I wanna see how big the trunk is on this thing. I just noticed it's got a backup camera, that's a must. You gotta have this. The privacy. Yes, check it out. We got the spare there as well. In case you're out on, you're out on some kind of special mission. Oh, you know what? Sometimes I get squashed in the back seat. This is decent. Cup holders come down. Yeah, there you go. More cargo. We need to check out the sound system, right? The system is searching for your phone. Using your handset, look for a Bluetooth device called My Car. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Picture us, Jack, huh? We're cruising, Star Wars style. So you get the multimedia controls on the wheel. So what you guys are looking at here is a legitimately limited Nissan Rogue. So if you're a Star Wars fan and you're, you're looking for 
your vehicle to somehow commemorate your love for the Star Wars universe, this is as close as you're ever gonna get. And there's only 5,400, 5,000 in the US and 400 in Canada. This helmet, which I unboxed first of this Death Trooper, this thing in and of itself is completely limited. The only way to get this is along with the vehicle. So that's included. You've also got the custom paint setup where You've got blacked out rims, blacked out handles, as well as the roof rack, the LED headlights, the LED indicators, and of course the entire interior. If you've got a family member, a friend, anybody you know who's into Star Wars, you gotta share this one because this thing is incredibly limited and incredibly unique.